Papua New Guinea project started operations in late April this year and shipped out very first LNG in late May. The project started operations as many as six months earlier than originally scheduled. Far earlier than expected startup came as US major ExxonMobil, the oper operator of the project, was believed to have set a very conservative plan for the startup. Since the long-term contract was scheduled to start in October or November this year, ExxonMobil had no choice but to sell all the cargoes out of the project in the spot market. The project has a nameplate capacity of 6.9 million tons per year. This means that the project ships out 7 to 8 cargoes per month. This caused oversupply situation in the Asia-Pacific region and resulted in strong downside pressure in ex-ship Northeast Asia spot prices. This became a major reason why the market hit the lowest levels since the Great East Japan earthquake in March 2011. Prices like low to mid tens per MLBTU back in late January, late July, when spot cargoes for September delivery were mainly discussed.